Have you ever exported a footage that didn't look like what you were editing? I'm going to show you today on DaVinci Resolve on how you can export your footage properly for your social media like YouTube, Instagram, or TikTok. Let's hop in. First, go to the right hand corner and press the gear icon. And then go to the color management setting. Here, if it says Rec 709 Gamma 2.4, this is the reason why that your colors are coming out differently from the way you see on your current timeline. So in order to export the footage with a proper color profile, change the setting to Rec 709A. So Rec 709A basically allows you to export your footage exactly the way you see and exactly the way you color graded on your timeline. So if say you made a custom timeline setting, in this case, go into your media folder, look for that timeline, right click, then go to timeline setting. Then go into the color tab and change the output color space to Rec 709A. Now go into your deliver page and go down to the advanced setting. Change your color space tag to Rec 709 and your gamma tag to Rec 709A. This is not really required, but it's better to be safe than sorry. So change the setting here to, in order to make sure that DaVinci exports the footage with the proper color profile. So after you export the footage, this is a side-by-side -side comparison. The top is the timeline footage that I recorded on OBS, and the bottom is the exported footage. And there you have it. A small minor change that you could do to export your footage with a proper color profile. Although if you like more editing tips, as always, stay hungry, stay creative, and I'll see you on tomorrow's video.